Hello from Virtual Obstacle Shows. Today we're going to discuss how to navigate a lunge circle in an in-hand class for Virtual Obstacle Shows. Our model today, aka Victim, is Ruby. And we are not going to judge anything on this class, including how fat, out of shape the horse is, or the fact that she hasn't done any in-hand work for two years. In our explanation here, we do an obstacle. Lead our horse over to where we have a lunge line waiting. We don't care if you use a lunge line, a lead rope, a long lead rope, or what. What we do care about is that your horse waits patiently and everything is organized. Send your horse out on a circle in whichever format you prefer to use. Once your horse is on that circle, you should immediately ask for whatever gait is called for. Do not continue to move your horse at a circle at a walk until you feel like moving forward. Complete your however many circles and ask for the stop immediately. We're looking for a horse that listens, that responds quickly, and does not take too much time. A couple of different ways that people send their horses out on these circles. One that we saw where you push your horse out, you get them out to the end of your lunge, and then you ask for the gate, for the gate that you're asking for, whether that be a trot or a lope. Another format that a lot of in-hand people use is to send their horse backwards. We're good with this as long as the horse is responding to whatever the handler is asking with respect and a willing attitude. Again, so your horse is at the end of the line. Get them onto your circle and immediately move into whatever gate you're asking for. Hopefully your horse doesn't throw a fit bucking up and down because they've been on pasture rest for two months. And again, make sure your start and stop points are very defined. Wherever you started your gate is where you need to ask for that stop. All right, everybody have fun. Enjoy your ride.